Hi guys, welcome to Mix Studies. Today we are going to learn a most commonly used parameter in psychometry that is dry bulb temperature. So what is dry bulb temperature? How to measure it? How we can define it in psychometry? We will talk about all the basic details. We will take a basic thermometer. Look at this thermometer. So this is the bulb of a thermometer and different temperatures are marked on the body of this thermometer. So this is the bulb and it has mercury and we all know that mercury will expand even it takes a small amount of heat. So this is the mercury in the bulb. If we keep this bulb or the mercury in normal atmospheric air it will take the heat from the air and mercury will expand look at this picture so this is a commonly used thermometer and here bulb is taking heat and mercury is expanding this bulb is kept atmosphere at dry conditions so this bulb is called dry bulb and the temperature we measure with the help of this dry bulb is called dry bulb temperature. Now it has few conditions. Let's see the thermometer and we are putting some moisture in the bulb. What do you think? This bulb is dry? No. So the temperature will not be dry bulb temperature. So first consideration is bulb should be dry and away from moisture. If we keep some heat source where from radiation may come and it can affect the bulb. Here the temperature of the mercury will increase. Suppose without radiation if it reaches to 37 degrees centigrade, then in case of radiation, it will go more than that, say it is 41 degrees centigrade. So bulb should be away from radiations. These two considerations should be considered for dry bulb temperature. We can define dry bulb temperature. It is the temperature of air measured by a thermometer freely exposed to the air but shielded from radiation and moisture and it is abbreviated as dbt so dry bulb temperature means dbt as well we have already seen how the psychometric chart looks like now we will try to point out dry bulb temperature in psychometric chart so we have learned this is the outline of a psychometric chart and this is the reason of dry bulb temperature normally it is written as degree centigrade or degree fahrenheit and dry bulb temperature looks like 0 degree centigrade 5 degree centigrade 10 15 20 25 to 55 degree centigrade so dry bulb temperature here is shown in degree centigrade or degree Fahrenheit scale. Let's indicate dry bulb temperature in a practical psychometric chart. So this is the dry bulb temperature line and look at this. These all lines indicates the dry bulb temperature. We can easily find out the dry bulb temperature between these two lines like 20 and 25. We can find out 21, 22, 23, 24 as well. And even in the any temperatures between any lines. Let's do a small exercise. We'll try to find out dry bulb temperature for 44 degree centigrade and 23 degree centigrade. So this is the psychometric chart. 44 means we have to see dry bulb temperature between 40 and 45. So this is the 44 degree centigrade and 23 means we have to see between 20 and 25. So this is the DVT line of 23 degree centigrade. 
Now what will be the dry bulb temperature at this point or this point? It will be same as like 23 degrees centigrade. Any point in this dry bulb temperature line will have the same temperature. So we have got a very basic idea about dry bulb temperature. I hope you enjoy this video. Thank you so much and please visit makestudies.com.